Welcome back everyone to CK2 Plus as Empress Constance of the Second Carolingian Empire, or for short, of Francia. Uh, what I wanted to show you right now is the rebellion that's uh, happening, or the revolt that's happening in the Holy Roman Empire. Uh, it looks like a really small revolt, but it does have some very strong support from our kin in Austria, who seems to be, uh, yeah, the main force in this fight. Um, but they're being defeated, as you can see here. We've had two pretty, yeah, two armies of the same size, as you can see. Uh, 1,700 Holy Roman forces against... Uh, actually, no, there's, there was an advantage of, uh, of rebels. 17,000 men against 16,000, and they had the river on their side. But it seems like the... Yeah, the Holy Roman forces are just overall strong. That is kind of surprising to me, but yeah, there it is happening. And in the meantime, we have been spying on the Lionheart, one of our best commanders, a Welsh nobleman uh, in control of the Duchy of Hereford here. And he, um, he does not like the Duchess Beatrice of Somerset. And we can now go for rivalry. And I think that's exactly what we will do. So, yeah, make the attempt, 65% chance to inflame a rivalry. And, um, uh, th that's just nonsense. Uh, wow, that actually worked out. I don't know if that worked out better. Uh, a few rumors spread in the courts of both him and the Duchess resulted in a mutual dislike blossoming into a new rivalry. Now all that remains is to see where this leads. And he immediately declared war. That is actually freaking fantastic so yeah um now you have to deal with this guy the problem is you don't actually have a chance you've got three thousand men do you have any alliances yeah the duke of somerset but he's not really helping uh and you've got nine thousand men and probably no you don't have any friends either um i could force him to go for peace but Okay, maybe this didn't actually work out. I just fucked over the Duchess of Somerset, to be honest. Um, yeah, maybe that wasn't perfect. Yeah, you know what? I think this wasn't exactly ideal, what I just did. Uh, I don't think this helps anyone. <laughs> to be honest, I just, I just kind of forced one of my vassals to die. That is not cool. And there is a second war between the Duke of Burgundy... And uh, who's actually currently fighting? Oh, no, that's not true. That's not. They're not fighting a revolt. Uh, you've got five thousand men, and the Duke of Berry has four thousand. I think he's gonna lose this. I think he's gonna lose this one. But anyways, uh, what's going on here? Mm, you have yeah thirty-five percent. Yeah, you've got no chance. I don't know why I was doing this. Hmm. Glory faction is now unhappy. Sorry, not much I can do about that, honestly. Uh, yeah, well, shit. Um, why did I do that rivalry thing? Probably was a stupid... I mean, to be fair, I didn't know they would fight immediately. That was kind of not what I had expected. And there goes the Burgundian forces. No, actually, Barry is defeating Burgundy. Burgundy's gonna lose Nevers again. Ugh. Alright, well, fine. We need a new court chaplain. Because apparently the other one... Is incapable. Well, we'll go with this bishop then. Thanks. And please return to cultural tech. That would be amazing. Um, don't know if we can actually build anything, but we probably should try. Separated wards. Pilgrims in. We can go for quarantine. Physicians will examine all incoming travels. Uh, sure, why not? Let's go for that. Let's let's do that. Actually, let's build that everywhere in all of our trade posts. We can't build that in all of them. That's kind of a shame. But I would love to. But I guess we'll, we're lacking some technology there. So we've got soup kitchens everywhere, except here, where the hospital's still being built. We could go for this. Huge investment, but it might be worth it. Maybe a library would be cool too. Well, you know what? Let's let's continue building, upgrading the hospital here. 
This is a big deal, but we still get 600 gold left. I think this is fine. We can allow this. And yeah, so Burgundy, despite having more men initially, is losing. That's not too good. And Duke of Normandy, you are in the court faction. And you're married to the Duchess of Bedford. Uh, we'll do nothing for now. I think it's fine. The court, I mean, he can stay in the court faction. Like, that doesn't matter. And Lucia has now repositioned to the Balearic Islands. Um, that's nice. Still uncrowned, but married to the King of Castile, Navarra, and Leon. This is pretty amazing. Oh, look at this. So, this dude somehow managed to solidify Castile, Navarra, and Leon. And now he's also going to get Andalusia. And perhaps he's also... Wait, hold on. This guy looks exactly like your heir. Or at least close enough to fool me. Okay, well, maybe not that close. But yeah, and he might actually get Aragon under control as well. This is actually kind of cool. I'm, I'm rooting for this guy. Uh, getting four kingdom titles um, under control here. But yeah, anyways, I keep getting distracted. There's other things that we need to uh, check out. Uh, we've resieged this. And now, where are all of our commanders? Alright, you're fighting your own war. Well, I wouldn't mind you fighting my wars first. If that's at all possible. It seems to be. The Duke of Corvuna has uh, died. He was uh, died in battle against the Earl of Dublin. Oh, he was leading here, apparently. Well, that's too bad for him. But thanks for, thanks for fighting. An Aquitanian war on the Duke of Toulouse. He's got 8,000 men. Now, this is actually a big deal. Well, she's got 18,000 troops. Holy shit. And she likes us. Why does she like us again? Outraged, but her faction is pleased. Alright. We've captured some Earl. We've actually captured the lead up beforehand. And we've had him uh, ransomed. Wow, we're actually making some real bank from this war. That's kind of amazing. Yeah, thanks for the ransom. Do we have anyone else that we can ransom right now? Yes. No, that's a plot. And we still got this bishop. 25 gold. Don't mind if I do. Um, can we get the siege leader in here maybe? I mean, come on. At least get this done quicker. Thanks for the ransom. Vassal inheritance. Yeah, I don't think that's going to happen, so... I do not care. Let's finish off this army. And Kent declared a war. I wonder what's going to happen here. I don't know what the rivalry war does. And wow, we captured him again? Come on. Come on, really? How are we doing this? Well, I'm going to take the ransoms. Um, and I think we're going to plan a feast after this. We might not be able to ransom this guy before a peace is uh, concluded, which is fine. But I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't have minded some extra money. But yeah, he's not getting any more. So yeah, that's that. We're gonna be at peace. Yep, there goes the revolt. The end of that. We build a sick house in here. So let's build up that soup kitchen. Thank you. And what to do next? Wow, look at this. So many just prospering and even flourishing and even booming places in France. What is uh, France just flourishing? I definitely want F France to boom. So what we need to do for that is go for a feast. Prosperity our capital increases. That's what I want. A summer fair and a hunt. Sure, let's just do everything. And we can also give to charity. Yes. We'll do everything. We'll just spend the money. Like we don't need it. Perfect. Okay, we actually... That actually helped. The tradition faction was not really happy. And now they are. Um, no, I think we're going to keep an eye on this guy. Because he is kind of problematic. Yeah. This guy, the Count of Dublin... We will be merciful. Will we be merciful? I think we will be merciful. Uh, I think... I mean, depending on how much money you make. I might even... I might actually keep you in prison for a while. That's fine. Yeah. Approve of honesty. 
Here's your money. I don't ever want to see you here again. That sounds harsh. And it costs us more gold. The trainer beat the monkey with a stick. Biting him and hitting him. Hmm. I don't care. I shouldn't be, be thinking about this for that long. And wow. Holy shit. There it goes. We just inherited big time. So many duchies. Okay. So Duchess Teresa has died with her... Um, how's the burn has died off. Okay. And we should pause. Alright, so, we've inherited so many freaking things. Um, now here's what I will do. Pretty simple, actually. First of all, let's stand down my personal troops and my vassal levies. Which, what? I should have a lot more, but this might be because we're over the limit. Um, we're not in a war. Okay, we're far over our vassal limit. I get that. Okay, so let's see what we have. Part two. Okay. So this guy, French, he's a proud man. Or we give it to the girl. She hates us absolutely. Wants to kill someone who is Domingo and Julian. The Melgiel. You are Duke of Auvergne. Okay, I don't think. I'm gonna give you the Duchy of Puerto. There you go. That's one man made happy. Uh, we've got some Algarve is what we have. We have the Duke of Faro, so it has to be this guy. He's content. Yep, let's give him... Nope. Algarve. This could take a while, but I think uh, I'm still going to show you. There you, go. you can obviously skip forward if you do not care about this at all. Um, Tangiers, we need to give out. Yeah, so there's people that have suggested that I... Oh, I love this martial lady, to be honest. Because she is, um... Like, she's ambitious, but she is content. So, yeah. Uh, people have suggested to make super vassals, which I don't want. Uh, I think this is... This is perfectly fine the way it is. Okay, you absolutely love me. You have a... This looks so cool. She's McGrebby, but she doesn't look McGrebby. This is... She's kind of amazing. Um, and you are very pretty as well. But that does not actually matter, I suppose. Uh, yeah, I'm not going to do that because I I think we'll, it's time that we split these guys up. It's been for far too long that they're that powerful. So there's a lady... Mm, there's a, they're all Oxten. They're not, none of them are actually French. Uh, we do have Al Jazeera here, which is a pretty great capital. Hmm. I mean, I wouldn't mind this guy, charitable man. Hmm. Let's see. You know what? I will make my friend. Ah, there you go. I will give you Al Jazeera. I'll put you in the south there. You can protect my. You can protect that. There you go. Lower titles. Duchy of Clemson. Enjoy. Cool. So our friend is completely happy over there. And um, we're still quite over our limits. Oh, that's crazy. What's this down here? This is the Duchy of Sevilla. Those are some really great duchies. Hmm. You are insane. This guy is not. But he's got an ambitious son. You're a little bit of an idiot. But also insane. Holy shit. What's going on? This guy seems to be kind of the best option. 
Yeah, so I will make you, I will grant you the title of this one and the Duchy of Sevilla. Enjoy. Perfect, good for you. We need more advisors as well. So how many more duchies do we have? So Aquitaine, France, Champagne, Upper Pyrenees. Ah, oh, we hold this. Ah, oh, damn it. I don't think we have anyone left of that family, right? Yeah, you you died. You died off. That's so unfortunate. Is your house still alive? No. Hmm. And the Baron is dead too. House Foku is dead. House La Roque, whatever, still has members. Abdul. Voldensian, Catholic. Well, he has the best claim. If he was to come to my court, where are you? Count of Andalusia. Yeah, well, that's your own fault. If you were to come to my court, you would, uh, you would get some stuff. Why do you not want? I'm not going to press your claims. I'm going to actually give you your claims. You idiot. Yeah, fine then. I guess. Good luck getting your claims. How about you? Invite to court. Well, fine then. I'm going to have to give this to someone else. I would have loved to give it to you. Alright, so, not sure what I'm going to do here. So many freaking titles, god damn. Alright, you know what, guys? Uh, this will actually take quite a long time. Um, so, this is not necessarily the most interesting thing to do. Uh, I will try and find some good vassals I can give these lands to. Um, I'll cut this episode a little bit shorter, and next time I'll be back and I'll show you exactly what I have done. But, that will be it for now. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.